I can see a determined, very strong woman who will not take any problem to defeat themselves. Ba't ako naiiyak? Oh. Ano ba yan? Ba't kaya ganyan? You know, yeah, I can tell you, you know, the best, you know, uh, carve out of stone ka na eh. You have so much experience, you can share for others like what you're doing right now. You're enlightening others. My blessing pa yan, di ba? Oh, hmm. You are young. You're very young. Oh, my God. He started at 11. My gosh. Okay, Kath, you know, three decades of following your dreams mm -hmm. and three decades of challenges, yes. ups and downs, I, I suppose, right? Yes, yes. Papa. Sabi nga nila, success is not a straight line. Mm. You know, it's always, uh, you know, mm. curves, yeah, curves, diba? curves, ups and downs. So, uh, and you manage, you know? You've evolved into something very strong and, you know, it's still Thank fascinating. You. You, so, what's in store for the next 30 years for Kathleen Hermosa? Uh, what's, how can you see yourself? What's the dream that you have for Kathleen Hermosa 30 years from now, when you're my age? <laughs> oh wow you really look young oh thank yes, you oh, thank you i know um simply lang talaga ang gusto ko ah mm -hmm. uh, i really actually i commend the uh, the name that my sister built mm -hmm. like in her acting career and ako naman i really would like to have my own brand mm -hmm. to inspire more young ones and not to be able to waste so much time dwelling on the problem but moving on you know things like that like if i could shorten the wasted time on their part by just inspiring them nice. and telling them beautiful gusto ko po yun. yun talaga yung mm -hmm. the next 30 years or a brand like say a show something that i can really um, that them. my yes po, my nice. grandchildren or my pamangkins mm -hmm. would watch, ganyan. What else? And, well, ang fire talaga in my heart right now, mm -hmm. eh, gusto ko talagang matulungan mama ko. Kasi she's getting old, that's okay. why. Gusto ko, she would stop working na. Okay. Ganyan. Very nice. How Yun many po. siblings do you have? Four. Four. And are you the youngest? Eldest. Are you the eldest? Yes. yes. Oh, wow. <laughs> nice, nice. And uh, well, that's a very admirable um, dream, okay? Yes. Po. Or goal, right? Because mm -hmm. uh, uh, when your dream is just for yourself, you mm -hmm. know, kuminsan, the for you know, pwede nating abandon ka agad yes, yun. Yes, that's exactly. Tama. Pero pag ka yung goal mo or yung dream mo is bigger than yourself, yes. that means it includes other, other people. people. Uh, you're more uh, stronger in facing challenges because failure is not an option. Yes. Tama ba? Yes, po. You know, so I admire you for that. And of yes, course, po. charity begins at home. Siempre family yes, po. Yun muna, po. di ba? Pero yun nga po. I have basta and dami ko po. It would be a long talk if I okay. would tell you my dreams. I'll talk to you in <laughs> private. Yes, <so>. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> and like what you said, you know, well, you know, with years, what's good with aging is like you, ca it comes experiences with yes, it. Po. So, yes, you know. po. So, anyway, uh, what can you advise the young ones or many of our kababayan mm -hmm. na ang dami nilang pangarap na parang naka-parking ngayon kasi parang may excuse ngayon eh you know mm -hmm. um yung yung nangyaring pandemic mm -hmm. parang bang na-justify na wala muna silang gagawin about their pangarap yes ano ang advice mo para sa kanila na walang parking parking pag may pangarap you know lagi kang naka mm -hmm. primera segunda Tercera, di ba? Mm -hmm. Laging naka-drive. Mm -hmm. Hindi pwedeng parking, right? Yes, po. How, what can you advise them? 
Okay. Um, for yeah. all of you watching um, po right now, and you are on your parking mode, <laughs> okay, normal lang po yan. Pero alis ka na. Alis yes. na po tayo. Kasi drive na. Drive na. Because you can only allow yourself to stay in one place for a short period of time. You mm -hmm. cannot let yourself dwell because dadating ang time, magsisisi ka, ang dami mo nang na-waste na time. Tapos hindi mo na magnagawa yung mga gusto mong gawin. So right now, even if we know, like ako po, ang ano ko, kahit na alam ko, wala akong magagawa, sabay-sabay yung mga nangyari, um, sinangyari sa ABS-CBN, ang mother station ko po, hmm. tapos um, pandemia, ganyan, tapos wala talagang work, um, walang lumalabas, ganyan. Nag-focus ako sa sarili ko. Basically, I realized that we have to reassure ourselves, love ourselves first, na kaya natin. Kasi if ganito ang nangyari, mawawalan ka talaga ng, ng drive, mawawalan ka ng inspiration, ng fire in yourself. Mm -hmm. Di ba po? Mawawalan ka ng hope eh. Parang, hala, pwede palang mangyari to. Even sa mga giants na, pwedeng bug mawala. Yes. Sa mga rich people, isang sakit lang pala, wala na, ganyan. Ako, um, ang ginawa ko po, maybe it, maybe it may work for you as well, na we concentrate on our strengths. Huwag na yung weakness. Huwag na yung weakness kasi that will also pull us down eh. So, ano bang kaya mong gawin? Ano bang meron ka? Um, ako po, ang ginawa ko, I spent my time uh, preparing breakfast for my pamangkins and my oh, family. Oh, nice. So, eventually... You feel, looking, you feel productive. You feel productive. Feel productive. I also learned to um, jog, walk, or exercise. Ganyan. Watch what I eat. Mm -hmm. Ganyan. And also, bantay na bantay ko ang information that comes in my mind. Whatever I hear, whatever I watch, whatever I speak, kailangan all positive lang po. Yun po talaga yung ang bilis Tama. po kasing maapektuhan ako oh. when it comes to that. So, oh. Yun talaga, nakatulong yun sa akin. Like, so, tama yung sabi mo, uh, bawal, hindi po talaga pwedeng mag-parking tayo ngayon. Yes. Kasi excuses and results doesn't come hand in hand. Pagka meron kang, wala kang result, ibig sabihin, yung person na yun mag-excuse. Mm -hmm. Ang daming pwedeng gawing excuse ngayon, yes. lalo na na may pandemic. Yes, yes. So, ang daming pangarap na naka-parking Mode. mode ngayon. Apart. Remember, what's the richest place in the world? The cemetery, right? Ah. Kasi ang cemetery, nandun ang maraming broken dreams and, you know, unfulfilled dreams. Yes, yes, diba? yes. And, uh, people who Dying has a better or bigger potential that they were not able to manifest, right? So, uh, let's not go there, you know. Um, being productive ang key. Tama ka doon, Kat. Um, yung feeling ng productivity na yung au oras, kasi hindi natin maibabalik ang oras eh. Sayang yung oras. Pagka naging productive ka sa isang araw, kahit walang bayad, kahit yes. walang bayad, kahit yung feeling ng productivity is really a gasoline for our feeling of being uh, in enthusiastic or being Driven. productive again. Yes, diba? Magiging ano kayo, yung meron kang, wow, may natapos ako ngayon. You know? And then, mas inspired ka. Magbubu ngayon. Mayroong snowball effect yun. Ganon din yung unproductive. Pag wala kang ginagawa, tendency, you go rotten. You go downhill. Right? So, you know, you're doing, you're on the right track. And really, para po sa ating mga followers na may mga pangarap, maliit man, simple man, o napakalaki, pero hinaharap ninyo ang maraming challenges ngayon, huwag po kayong mag-parking mood. You know, develop yourself. Learn like what Miss Kathleen is uh, saying. You know, um, this is the time where you can just go on the internet and mm. learn new things uh, becomes you know maybe you can decrease the quantity or the magnitude of your dream but never stop dreaming because mm. dreaming is some is very essential yes, pag wala ka ng dream parang wala ka ng purpose eh diba mm.
Kathleen, I have one question. Yes, of course. Si Kathleen ngayon, okay, mm -hmm. 2021, looking at the Kathleen, the 11-year-old Kathleen, what would you advise her? Um, okay. Okay, I'd call my my real name mm -hmm. Michelle Kathleen po kasi ako. Okay. So ako, um, Michelle Kathleen, Michelle. Naiyak na naman ako. Ano ba 'yan? <laughs> Alam ko na 'to, eh, pero naiyak pa din. <laughs> ano? Yun. Um, Mabait kang bata. Huwag mong isipin na matigas ulo mo. Gusto mo lang talagang matuto on your own. Gusto mong ma-appreciate. So you are appreciated. You are talented. Gifted. Gifted. Um, you are loved. You should know that. Nandiyan ang mga magulang mo. You just have to focus on the positive side. Yung mga ikakabuti mo. Huwag mong maramdaman na pangit ka. In fact, ang tangkad mo nga eh. <laughs> Yun po. Um, yan lang. Mahalin mo pang sarili mo. Kung hindi mo mahal ang sarili mo, umpisahan mong mahalin ang sarili mo kasi kailangan mo yan. Kailangan mo yan. Uh, God... Pinaiiyak mo. Oh, yan. <laughs> <laughs> Yun po yung sasabihin ko. Tsaka God loves you so much. I'm proud of you. Okay? Thank you. Thank you I'm po. proud of you. You are an icon of a very strong child then. And a woman right now. Thank you. Thank Very you. Very strong. I don't think any movie star had ever relayed such a heartfelt message more than you. Thank you. Thank you know, it's it's really very enlightening. Especially, it's very timely. Very needed right now. Thank you so much again for sharing with us thank you. how you evolved from an 11 year old until <laughs> the Kathleen. Hermosa, that is, I you know, still developing yes, a work in progress, yes, you work know, in progress. and still with dreams, yes, none with dreams, never ending dreams, right? Yeah. Napakinggan po natin ang makulay at makasaysayang kwento ni Kathleen Hermosa sa kanyang paglalakbay, sa kanyang tagumpay, at mga pangarap sa buhay. Sana po na-inspire po namin kayo. Na, ako po talagang na-inspire po ako ni Kath. And uh, nakita po natin sa kanya na ang pangarap kailangan po talagang naglalagablab ang ating damdamin. Meron po tayong tinatawag na burning desire. At uh, wala pong pagsubok. Wala pong challenges na hindi natin haharapin Wala pong rejection, wala pong sakit, wala pong frustration na hindi natin kakayanin kapag ang pangarap natin ay buong-buo sa ating puso. Sana po magbigay po ng aral sa inyo, sa atin, lalo na po ngayong panahon na to ng pandemya, na marami pong pangarap na natutulog, na nilagay po natin, sinala na natin sa cabinet, o kaya sabi nga ni Kath, naka-parking mode. Sana po, Huwag niyo pong itigil. Huwag po kayong mawalan ng pag-asa. Lalo po ninyong pagsikapin, buhayin ang inyong pangarap. Dahil paggaling po sa puso ninyo at sobrang matindi ang inyong intensyon na makamit ito. Maarin po ang pandemyang to ay isa lang po sa mga baitang o kaya maging isang instrumento para mas mapaganda pa po ninyo ang inyong pangarap. Again, I would like to remind you, please listen, learn, and live happy. Ako po si Susan Barlin, ang inyong life coach dito sa Life Talk. Hello.
Thank you for 